Hello guys and welcome to a jersey unboxing which we haven't done in a while. I'm doing a Detroit Tigers jersey unboxing while I'm wearing a Detroit Tigers jersey because they play today and I didn't have this jersey yet. <clears throat> but now I have it. One of my all-time favorite Tigers since, you know, I was a little, little kid. You may be saying, Luke, about a year ago you already did a Brandon Inge jersey unboxing. I've outgrown that jersey so I had to buy a new one and it was only like $36 so it was used on eBay it's $36 so I thought it's a men's extra large why not you know that's the size that I wear jerseys in like the large to extra large range so ooh, it's from Indiana a Tigers jersey from Indiana I was a bit off caught off guard by that Oh my goodness, this is beautiful. Look at that. Look at the old Tigers. Oh, the old, old jock tag from back in the day. Back in the day, and the old Tigers English D where it's a bit thicker and not as skinny as the new ones. These are a lot better than the Fanatics ones now. <laughs> and then there is the Brandon Inge on the back number 15 one-time all-star for the Detroit Tigers sorry Jack Morris but I gotta take your jersey off give me a second I am wearing it it's beautiful look at it make sure it fits in the frame Brandon Inge was never the most flashiest player for the Tigers, but he was definitely one of the most more solid, solid guys that I think Tigers fans enjoyed for a while. He he gave us a good 10 years, 10, 11 years of, of his career and the majority of his career, and it panned out pretty well, and he was a good player for the, for the Tigers um, when they were at their lowest and when they were at their highest. So always, always appreciate Brandon Inge. And uh, what he did for the Tigers back in the day. I, I got to watch him a little bit growing up. And first Tigers jersey I ever had. Number 15, Brandon Inge. So, nice to have uh, one that I can wear every day now. And add to the Tigers collection. See you guys next time. As always, I'm not funny. And, hope you guys have a good day. Just got unlucky with on a few plays tonight. You know? One of those, one of those plays... I thought he was standing still, but he just hit the shit out of that one guy, and the guy went flying, they blew the whistle, and they called it on him.